Hello everyone, this is Bertina Amy here and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I thought we would do a last minute Mother's Day gift. I don't know if anyone else has done this idea before, but if there is someone else that has, I apologize. Feel free to mention who it is uh, down in the comments below. So in today's gift, I'm showing you how to do a DIY quick last minute Mother's Day gift bath bomb surprise. The idea of the surprise is that they won't notice a bath bomb until they pour the contents out into their bath. The first thing I'm doing is I'm removing the sticker from the bottom of the glass jar. Then I'm taking the sunflower with the leaves and taking the leaves, cutting them in half after I pull them off, and I'm gluing them around the outer edge of the lid. Then I'm pulling off a sunflower and cutting off the remaining stem. Then I decided to go ahead and glue the back end petals down to the lid as well to help cover up the metal part of the lid. I happen to have some Epsom salt lavender scented from Walgreens and I pour it into the jar until it's almost full and I leave enough space and I think about like 80% of it is full and then I go ahead and take the bath bomb. I remove the plastic wrapper and I just submerge it into there. I, I press it down so it stays nice and firm and then I cover it up with the rest of it with the Epsom salt. So then I go ahead and take this tag and write Happy Mother's Day to go along with the bee themed Mother's Day gift I'm putting together. It was clear to me that the little bit of twine was going to be way too small so I just used this lavender looking ribbon I had on hand that's sort of like what they would call Rick Rack. It's not stretchy but it'll work and I decided to cut it in half because I'm making two of these and then I'm going to fold the ribbon in half, stick the folded area into the hole, and make a loop with that ribbon and pull the remaining of the ribbon through that loop. Then I take the ends of the ribbon and wrap it around the jar and glue any excess to itself. And that's it for today's tutorial. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, comment, and subscribe for more. And we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.